In today's Little Farm Stories, we're enjoying the rare snowfall and looking at Clover, who is due to have her lambs in only five days. Hello, it's February 24th, and this is A Country Breath, and I'm Lisa Murata at Under the Feather, Feth, Under the Feather Farm. Sounds like I've got feathers in my mouth today. Only five more days. It's snowing as I'm writing this. I'm not sure I can really call it snow because the flakes are so tiny and few. It's more like frozen mist. It's not expected to snow much, so it will probably be gone in the morning. It'll be another cold day tomorrow and then back to rain for the weekend. This is the downpipe from the gutters that fills the big bin with quite the icicle. We don't get icicles out here very often either. Clover is due March 1st. She's getting very round and almost waddling, but it hasn't slowed her down very much. She's still the first out to get the grain in the morning and first back in for grain and alfalfa hay at night. You can really see how much of a bulge she has from this angle. I'm feeding them their evening grain and alfalfa hay in the barn. It's good for them to move around and she can still hustle. She also is the youngest, so maybe that's why she's so fast. Here's another picture of how wide she is. Flower is due March 3rd and isn't showing as much. I wonder if Clover has triplets. Her mum Sunshine had triplets last year. Singles and twins are common for baby dolls, but triplets are very rare. There are some sheep breeds where twins and triplets are quite common, but the baby dolls aren't that productive. Only a few more days and we'll know for sure. Join me tomorrow for a look at the different types of wool, or fleece as it's better known by fibre artists. And if you've enjoyed this video, please click that red subscribe button.